homeless for Labor Day. KNBC 9's Andy Alcock shows us the work the group is doing. I'm at St. Paul's Presbyterian Church at 29th and Victor, and I'm also joined by Greg Parr of Neighbor to Neighbor. And Greg, uh, we got a line going here. Uh, this is Monday, Labor Day, but it's just a Monday for you guys because uh, folks are in need, right? Uh, that's correct. I mean, be, being that it's a holiday, drugs uh, still exist, uh, liquor stores still open, you know, so we're here to serve the homeless and the near homeless uh, anytime we can because uh, drugs and uh, homelessness and crime don't take a break, unfortunately. And Greg, I know part of your mission, and you've had a lot of success stories, is getting people off drugs and alcohol. Tell us about how you're able to reach these folks and, and get their lives turned around. Well, fortunately, I have lived experience. I'm, I've been homeless myself for three and a half years here in Kansas City, and I was also arrested 97 times. Uh, you might want to add to that mistakenly, but uh, yeah. But uh, I have lived experience, and it's real important for someone to have lived experience to help someone that is still homeless and addicted to drugs. So every, every day at Neighbor to Neighbor, we mention about, about drug treatment, and we take about 8 to 15 people to treatment every month. And we have people that hang on 31st and Prospect, 27th Prospect, that are no longer on that corner. So we try to get one person at a time off those corners. What is the solution to solving the drug and alcohol problem that's so difficult for so many people, do you think? Well, a couple of things. You know, uh, one must believe in a power greater than themselves, and so do I, and must be give up on their self-thinking, right, because their, their best thinking got them high, and their best thinking got them drunk. So uh, we got to come to a bottom. And everybody got a different bottom. You know, it might be a guy got a hard head like me, you know, and get arrested 97 times, you know, <laughs> before I finally say, okay, I surrender. Yeah, but some people, you know, might have a flat tire and say, hey, I'm going to stop drinking, you know. So it depends on the person. Greg Parr, appreciate it. Thank you very much. Neighbor to neighbor, feeding the homeless here in Kansas City Monday through Friday, 52 weeks a year. In Casey Moe, Andy Alcock, KNBC 9 News.